tank up and survive this lane. If it was MV, oh, okay. Wait, is that mid? Going for the more uh, mana efficient build, kind of costing them the lane. And now here mid, we see a TP from Ocean. It's gonna slow the Dragonite down. Gunner, he's got that Flame Guard. Phoenix also coming in. They're gonna get the first blood onto Husky, killing the Dragonite. And that was DK who just used the Elder Dragon form. That's a huge kill. But uh, you see Brax actually rotating mid. They want to kill this DK once again. And Ember, he's going to go in. Chains, Gush, Ravish comes out. They're going to drop everything onto this Dragonite. Plus that Sunray, the percentage-based damage. Going to take him out. Saberlight TPing in. He's going to doom the Tidehunter. But that's the Tidehunter. Are you sure you want to be going on him? He's got a hood. He's fine. Wow. That was I mean, a I'm, cool rotation. That really was. That was so good. Especially with the Morphling pushing him very Dude. hard. You know that it's game, I, I, who called Pandago to top? I was solo killing the Viper, or the Timber Saw, yeah. I was mad he rotated. Oh, Doom oh, wait, hold on, Arrow onto the Tide into a Doom, so Kraken Shell will not be popping right away, and they're just gonna chase him. Oh, here comes the big blast from the top lane, gonna burst. Anyone, it would do like 2,500 mm -hmm. damage to a hero with Hood. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense, so... Going for his own personal build here, Simon Boy tanking right in front of the tower. He's gonna get blinked up by a DK, and they're gonna go all in onto him. Ice Blast comes out too, so the Sunray not healing, but the Doom will take the fall. Moon Meandle and Undying, they're gonna lose two heroes. They did manage to kill the Spectre, which is gonna create a little bit of a difference between the Morph and the Spec, but the mid tower is in a little bit of danger. Tidehunt is gonna be chased. He's playing under a ward, and they're gonna get the stun on, and they're gonna doom him. Ice Blast, everything being dropped for this Tidehunter. I mean, they had to do that, or else he probably would've just got away by clicking the hood and the magic wand. And it looks like that's the play they do to get this tier one middle. Both teams, that's what they're looking at. They wanna defend on the side of Zoomers, but it's gonna be really hard without that tanky Tide in the front lines. Bro, just that area of the map, so your cores can efficiently farm, and they start looking for Roshan. Look at Sami Boido. They have a great ward on them from Dubu. Oh yeah, they're gonna jump in. Sammy boy, they're just gonna get instantly bursted thanks to that ice blast. Wow, and th that's such a scary place to farm though, as Sammy boy and Zoomers. They're actually gonna run at them. Saberlight, he oh, bottom. In, though. They know Saberlight doesn't have a TP. This is a really good smoke from the Zoomers going down there. Just one chains into the Mystic Flare. Gonna top be enough. Up. Yeah, top lane. Once again, Sandboy getting jumped by the Dragonite. Ice Blast, Arrow, Star Storm. Sammy Boy, he just had... I feel like he's got the wrong read on this game right now as to where Undying are on the map. Yeah, like, I his last so two deaths, they were real. So Sammy Boy, you know, he's got to wake up a little bit here. And bottom lane, he's going to get jumped. Saberlight, Stun, Doom, Ice Blast comes out. But he's... Uh, no, not too much damage onto him right now. Comes in the Tide Hunter. Doesn't have a pipe or anything. Sammy Boy, it's getting close. He's dead. That Doom and Ice Blast. Oh man, and they're gonna tip him too. He kind of deserves it at this point. That's three real bad deaths. Did you think that one was- I think that in DPC. And like they're punishing Sammy Boy. It's not even like- Oh, Gunner. He, still, he got stunned up. Tidehunter also getting disabled, so he's not gonna be able to get the Ravage off right away, but they do get it any, in the end, and Doom dies. Brax though, now he's gonna be hunted down. There's no backup damage coming from the Zoomers. Like they use that Mystic Flare, they kill the Doom off, but- what after that? And it was just uh, Gunner trying to play around to create some kind of information. Not gonna cost him this Roshan. Yeah, and we saw the, the Ravage was talking about how Zoomer smoked and it didn't end up protecting the Oh, look at bottom. Two stomp into a Doom. And that's looking like a pretty easy kill. The backup from Zoomer's a little too far away. Brax gonna have to just uh, blink away and Skyrath just TPs on now. Even if bottom area, Skyrath is not there though for that burst damage. Oh, they're gonna jump onto the Ember. They just blow him up. <laughs> this Dragonite just stun. You know, they popped the BKV on the Doom. He didn't even use the Doom, so they still have that available. Tomato is not even hitting the tower. He's actually going into the Ancients area, scouting what is going on in here. Just letting Brile do the dirty work. I like this from a dime. This is really smart. Oh, they're going. They're going. Oh, the ravage onto the morph. They're trying to burst him, but he has so high HP. He's gonna pop the BKB. He's gonna turn it around. Saberlight does not have his BKB up, so he's gonna be the focus of this fight. And Phoenix super dead, but the Doom also dies here. Brawl gonna pop his BKB. Going after Brax. They're actually ignoring the Spectre for the time being. And Tomato, he's looking at Sammy. Brax does take a fall on the bottom side, but Sammy, you know, that's the big kill, right? The position, one hero. Yep, not gonna be able to get out of that one as uh, they weren't able to burst Tomato. He was sitting on like 2.8k health. 
Yeah. There was yeah. I, I really didn't feel like they had any chance of uh, really killing him there. Plus, he's got that Nether Shawl, which makes it very hard what they can with the hand they got. Oh, Ember gonna just get Blink stunned right after the slight. Arrow comes through. No real saves available apart from the Phoenix Sunray. That's not gonna be enough, obviously. The Ice Blast was on the way too, if it wasn't already enough to kill Gunner. And Gunner, he must be lost. Teeping up, Moonlight Shadow, and just kill. This like, Sam, me. exactly. It's so hard. And Bryo, with his Aghanim's Dragon Form, can just run over trees, get to these heroes so quickly. Save so like gonna drop the Doom onto the Titan there, and then they're gonna turn onto the Spectre. So the Titan can't even pop the Ravage to save the spec. And now they're gonna turn around for Brax. He's super dead. And uh, these are all just plays to keep Zoomers down while Roshan is waiting to spawn. They got the top outpost, they might just run. Yeah, and we're, you know, Undyne, they played very solid all game. But the first sort of like crack in their armor is you see Brow, you know, he's going for a moon shard. They're sort of starting to like pound uh -huh. around a little bit. Oh, wait, hold on. Saberlight blinking in. He's going to get that Doom onto the Tidehunter. That's the big target for them. They don't want that Ravage to come out. And oh my goodness, the Tomato Slide of Fish is going to burst through the Phoenix and the Tide there in the back line, though. We do see Gunner going for the Apparition. His Aeon is going to pop here. And Doombringer going to die inside the base as the buybacks do come out. Sammy Boy, he's gonna be the focus, the Ice Blast. Oh, no, so much burst damage from that Daedalus. And now the Titans are also gonna fall here. Gunner, he cannot afford to die. He's the last... Uh, yeah, last core left alive. And he's gonna have to zip on out of there. And they're just gonna take this Tier 3 plus the Rax with Morphling plus DK, who still has that cheese. They don't even need to use it. So Zoomers, they do spend all of their powers to kill what they can but it's just not enough to bring down be nerves and you know all these things kicking in at some point even when you're ahead i there was a qualifier where i played in where i was up 25k in game three where if i win that i got a ti and the game was thrown really okay yep the game was thrown it was That's a sad. ti7 qualifiers against tnc it was very very sad i will remember it till this day so I'm not gonna count out the zoomers just yet, but right now they're gonna blink stun onto Simon Boy. Ice Blast also coming out. Force staff in the Spectre. Spectre does not have buyback, and that's gonna be the Megas. It's looking like they're gonna seal the game right here. Mr. Gunner, he's the next target. And they still have a GG down, man. Zoomers. I think Sky's got this. Sky's got this. Yeah. He's got Ember does buyback. He's, he's, he's got doing a quite a bit of damage, you know, with the slight and the maelstrom. And his agonist. Yeah, gonna fall here. Morphling, they get their Aegis. They're gonna keep diving. GG's called. And that's gonna be it. Undying. That was so clean on their end. You know, you were talking a little bit about their items, but at the end, they, they've already played like 95% of the game that they needed to play properly. Um, Uh, and also being able to control the top side means Roshan controls a lot easier. But uh, Dyer has. Been... Oh, uh, one second. Let's watch this level one first. Yeah, this is this is a, this is a very impressive level one play here. Moonmeander is gonna skill up that disruption to set up the stun for the Lina. Did it kill him? Brio. Yep. Yeah, it's getting real close. Husky is gonna skill the fire spirits. He's gonna get frozen in place thanks to that cold feet. That's the first blood gone, but they should be able to get a return kill on to Dubu. Tomato hanging around, watching under his ward. And yep, just gonna be a one for one. I don't think it's like the worst situation. For uh -huh. Ocean, he's like, Ocean. he's doing his best to stop it, but. Oh, Husky also coming in here. Moon, he's gonna get the disruption. Dubu here to support. And Gunner coming in with that level three score shirt. He's actually looking to steal some creeps. Moon gonna get chased on by Husky and die by Bryle on the bottom side. Also gonna be able to pick off the Nyx Assassin. Gunner, Doom onto the Lina. But there's no real support apart from Husky. Husky's just gonna get right click down here, and that looks like a pretty poor play on Gunner's end. But maybe he just did that so he can get away, because he might have just died to Brile if Brile is back to two undying. Like Simon Boy doesn't know where they are right now, and Brax, he's gonna break their smoke. Also, just burrow on out of there. So another failed attempt from Undying. I feel like they're starting to run out of gas, aren't they? It does Brile. feel a little mid lane. Stun. Mana they might burn. Get a good turn. Purge onto the Doom. Doom onto the Lina, but the Lina can still right click with that fiery soul. Now disrupted on the Nyx Assassin. More Ricks coming out. So, okay. I guess the play en ended up working out because uh, they try to touch this Lina while the 
Moon Meander Shard Demon was right behind her, ready to save or go on the offensive with the purge. And honestly, like, I, I could. Because of Saber Light. For sure. Top Ocean, and smoke he, they see him. Yos. Oh, he, he can the carapace. Gonna, yep. Nice blink stun from Brax. That's going to be the reveal. One Lucent Beam. They get the kill. They do drop the epicenter. Mumiata did lose quite a bit of damage. A uh, bit of HP and then the purge. So Sankin just going to TP out now. Yeah, I think we're going to see a lot of acceleration here from four zoomers. Now 20, 30 more seconds. But for a hero like Luna, that's like three camps right there. Yeah, and look at the illusion rune. It did like an oh, extra... Oh, they're going in. Oh. Doom onto the Lina. They're going to get the disruption. But I'm not sure that matters. The epicenter is also going to come out. Bryle is in... Total danger. He's absolutely dead. Moon Meander. Gonna try to get away from this. Brax has another Burrow Strike. And that's gonna be another sweet kill there. Sammy Boy. You know, he doesn't have that BKB. But the Manta and two heroes of Undying being dead is gonna give him enough confidence to just go towards his tier 1 tower. They're gonna get that. They're gonna open up the map some more. Room Mother trying to run to... I think you're right. Like, they might have one play left on them. But, oh man. He's, he's just... They're Ooh. just going. Yep. BKB, he's gonna pop that. Ice Blast is coming out. Oh, the SD is gonna die to the Glaives. But they got the big Doom kill, though. The Doom didn't have Doom after all. So he's smoking back on Undying. They saw the Zoomer smoke up here. And oh, Sa oh, Sankey reveals the apparition. He doesn't jump right away, though. Brax wants a bigger kill. Look at Shadow Demon. The on oh, they see the Shadow Demon. That's the big kill. Moon Meander all on his own. Axe goes in. With the call onto the Phoenix, they want to kill the Phoenix before the egg and they, uh, you'll die. Luna as well, gonna get blown up. Thanks to Brawl coming in from the back. Brax now is in a lot of trouble. And this is the fight that Undying has been looking for. Ocean, he has no way to get away from this. And they're gonna go straight into that Roshan pit. Zoomers maybe jumping the gun a little bit while Doom was still reviving. And that was you know just what? a perfect play from Undying though, right? In there. So this might not be the fight Undying want to get, but they find Ocean though. Wait, the Glimmer actually missed. Oh, Doom onto Brawl. Get the, yeah, Doom onto Lina. That's the kill they want. They got the disruption onto Lina, trying to buy some time. Shadow Demon getting stunned up as well. That's the next priority kill. Are they going to go for it? Yep, Burrow. Mr. Nyx going to get the Impale onto the Shadow Demon. That's two really big kills. There's 70 seconds on both heroes. Wait, that's a lot of map control Zoomers can pick up. And Zoomers, you know, they had a little Wait, they're slip not bubble. done. They're not done. Can oh, they get Doom? Him. Oh, they got him. Oh, the Aghanim Shard. Lucent Beam going to be able to ground target and get the cancel onto the Apparition right there. And you know, oh, right? Because Zoomers. we know Brow TV bottom, but they had no idea. Everyone's just off they the map. No they don't want to get trapped in Roshan Pet. Exactly. They don't want to throw the game with Doom being on cooldown. Egg. The ocean. Like three more seconds left right now. Ocean, yeah. Yeah, where's the sentry? There it is. Uh, they dust the Nyx Assassin, but he was behind the tree, so they didn't see him quick enough. Now they're going to go on to Ocean. Ocean is dying call. rather quickly. Yeah, big call in the back. And the Phoenix is going to have to drop an egg really far away from the fight, though. Luna down the river is going to get annihilated by Tomato and Squad Bryle. Going to tank through that epicenter, not going to care one bit. And now Sankin also going to take the fall, too. Oh, man, what a disaster for Zoomers. They're handing this Roshan to Undying on a silver platter. And, and mm -hmm. like, honestly, I'm... One of the things oh, I'm looking... Nyx. Oh, The call, easy kill. Another pick off by Tomato there. One of the things yeah. I'm looking forward to the most, like, seeing how this team... Hopefully, I mean, we don't know yet. Oh, they actually, wait, hold on. They went for a play here with the Blink Hoof Stomp, okay. but Bryo gonna get that uh, BKB used. Before the Hustle comes out, and now a call onto Sanking. Aeon Disc does pop. They get the uh, Demonic Purge. He's got Aghanims on Moon Meander, so he's going to be able to drop two more Purges if needed. And he's going to keep on hitting that Tier 3. Zoomers couldn't even jump that Moonshot Demon who was exposed in front of their base because they are playing 4 versus 5. And oh, call. He cancelled it in the beginning, and now gets stunned by Brax. Doom comes out onto the Aegis Axe there. There is a refresher. There's got a second Doom available. Sanking gonna take the fall now. He instantly buys out. They hold the melee racks for now. Shadow Demon stunned up. Is it gonna be enough? The Saberlight going in onto the back. Husky does not have an egg. He's gonna be the main focus as Shadow Demon just took a fall. And Gunner, he's gonna die here. Not gonna be able to get his Doom off as the call came out first. And that's gonna be it. Zoomers. They lose this game number two as well. You know, we had high hopes for their draft, but it felt like Undying. They're just a better team. They were able to all play Zoomers. 
they felt at some point undying you know they were running out of gas their smokes couldn't really land properly and as soon as they got that blink